Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the YouTube channel. It is your boy O Nerd as per usual. And we're back again today after the great success that was the first day of Pokemon Nuzlocke, Nuzlocke Challenge. Sorry, a little tongue twisted there. But anyways, today we're back. We're back in Little Root Town or Village or whatever the crap it's called. And it's episode two. I'm excited to get right into it. Um, today... I don't think we're catching our first Pokemon because we don't have any Pokeballs, so these encounters that we're about to face do not count until we get our first Pokeball, which I think is on the other side of this route. So this first set of grass, these encounters don't mean anything. It'll just be to level up our little guy, Alfie, I believe is his name. So once again, while we're about to start here, Route 101, oh, sorry about that comment down below for any names and yeah I'm pretty much just gonna try and skate through here with as little difficulty as possible I right, just one fight I guess and our first sighting is a Wurmple glad I don't need to catch this guy jeez because you know Wurmples aren't really the greatest especially in late game but yeah we're just gonna do some quick tackling oh he missed haha <laughs> let's go Alfie hit him with a tackle again two shots. I mean, that's pretty sad, but good job. 15 XP. Good job, Alfie. Alright, and we're in Old Ale Old Ale Town or something like that. I don't know. But we'll just do the quick little heal, even though I didn't actually get hurt. It's just always safe in the Nuzlocke, but whenever you see a Poke Center, you go and heal up. Reset your PP on all of your attacks. And, yeah. Um, let's talk to any of these guys. Naturally, that means you're welcome to use it. Uh, Pokemon Cable Club. Basically, just telling you how you can link your Game Boys together. Pokemon Centers are great. It's a great tutorial. Okay, nobody gave me anything. Good. Great. Alright, and let's go up here. Hey, guy. Who works at the Pokemon? Uh, can I get you to come with me? Okay, sure. This is the Pokemon. We've got our blue roof. Variety of goods, Pokeball and junk. Promotional item, the potion. What? Thanks for a potion, guy. Wow. Thanks, random dude. Okay, that lady tells you how to save. Let's go on the Pokemart. Hey, guy. Can I buy anything from you? Can't buy any Pokeballs, but I can buy some antidotes. So we're just gonna buy up. Two of those, I guess. Thanks. I'll get two paralyzed heals. And I'll get one awakening, just in case somebody falls asleep. That's probably not going to happen for a little while, at least. And we'll grab three more potions. We can't buy any Pokeballs yet, so the Nuzlocke actual challenge hasn't started yet for catching any Pokemon. So we're good. And let's also take a look and see if. Uh, these guys will give us anything. Just some more tutorial. Cool, cool, cool. How about you, lady? Uh, nope. They don't have any Pokeballs at the moment. Okay. What's this guy doing? Just discovered footprints of a rare Pokemon. This guy's gonna not let us go that way because he's sketching footprints. Um, what is this lady doing in here? Come on, battles. Whatever, whatever. Whatever, that reminds me that I need to set my battle style. So we'll go ahead and go do that real quick. No, I don't want to save. Not right now. Options. Battle style, switch it to set. Cool. Also speed up that. Battle, whatever, junk, all that stuff's great. And we can go back now. There we go. And let's check this last house before we go to Route 102. Oh, there's two people in here. Pokemon battles eventually level up and become stronger. Thank you. And yeah, you can go farther away from here. Yeah, because you need strong Pokemon. Right. I don't have my running shoes. It's really weird. I guess they don't get them yet. Oh, 103. Oh, here's our second battle. Ooh, a Poochina. I don't actually know if I'm supposed to be going this way. Probably go back in and talk to what's his name. Especially if I get wrecked here. Yeah, 
just gonna run. I think the play is to just go back and talk to the old guy, because maybe that was what I was actually supposed to do. <laughs> Whoops. Alright, yeah, let's just fast forward here, got away safely. Let's run back. Da, 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 da. All right. Let's see. Let's see if this is what I was supposed to do. Hey, guy. Oh, I gotta be on Route 103. Okay, so I gotta go find him and kill her. What did I go find her for? I got one Pokemon. I don't have any Pokeballs. I don't, do I? Oh, wrong button. It's my bad. Okay. So, thanks, big guy. Let's check my bag. I don't think I have any Pokeballs. Nope. No Pokeballs. Okay. So maybe I do have to be up here. So I should probably level up this guy a little bit. So we're just gonna do some quick fighting. Down here, I'm probably gonna get him to level 7. Thank you. Level 6. Mud Slap. Great. Okay, here's another one, Zigzagoon, level 2, Tackle, Growl, Tackle, Dead. Alright, here's another Zigzagoon, Tackle, 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 oh, one more Tackle. There we go, nice. Alright, one more fight should cover me to level 7. And these Wurmples are giving me a run for my money, jeez. <laughs> I'm getting beat up by them. Alright. Level up? Yeah, level 7. Alright, awesome. So now I can go heal up just in case I have to fight Mei, which I don't really want to. But it could happen. Maybe I'm helping her catch a Pokemon or watching her catch a Pokemon. It's probably what's actually going to happen. We'll see. Alright, we're going to go up here. We're going to go here. She's all the way up here. Perfect. What do you have for us, May? What are you doing? Oh, hi. Oh, I see your dad as a gift. Since we're here, let's have a quick battle. I only got one Pokemon. <laughs> but I have to fight you with only one Pokemon. What is this? Alright, you only got one, too. Trico! Wow, nice. Good pound. Mud slap. Okay, that didn't do it. <laughs> but it did lower his accuracy. So, he's gonna... He's more likely to miss now. Alright, tackle looks like the way to go. Alright, one more tackle should take him out. If not, then I'm gonna heal just to be safe. All right, cool. 69 XP. <laughs> Level eight, let's go. Awesome. That was an easy battle. A lot easier than I expected. And I got 300 bucks from it. Cool. I think, got an eye on you now. I already liked you. Making friends, great. See you back at the lab, okay. She wants to race. I'm um, gonna catch up. Ah, dang tree. Alright. Now the challenge is about to start. We're about to catch our first Pokemon here. Just a second. Yeah. Cool. I got the Pokedex. Let's go. Nice. Okay, she goes everywhere with it. You can catch rare Pokemon. You can learn about what they are. Great. Oh, wow. You got what you like through. It's so cool. Ooh, and I got one Pokeball. Wow. All right. <laughs> Thanks. All right. I can't can't get anything from you. All right. So we're ready to catch first Pokemon, guys. Here we go. Oh wait. Oh, here comes the running shoes. Thanks, Mom. That's great. Okay. Thanks. Thanks for the running shoes. Press the B button. Great. Yup. 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 Alright, you 
Yeah, you can stop talking to me now, lady. Thanks. I'll see you never. Alright, guys. This is it. First Pokemon. Who's it gonna be? A Warpole! Wow, what a surprise. Alright. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna we're gonna catch him because I need more Pokemon. So let's hit him with a tackle. And we should be able to catch him now. Alright. First catch, guys, here we go. Drum roll, please. I think this is a guaranteed catch, but just to be safe, I'm gonna, you know, hit him once to give him the respect that Wormple deserves. <laughs> All right, so we got a Wurmple. All right, awesome, awesome, awesome. He's been added to the Pokédex. He's a foot tall, weighs seven pounds. It's a big old worm, dude. Huge worm. And of course, we're gonna give him a nickname. And first person to comment down below in the first video was actually Sidman, and he ended up just saying it's gonna be a great series. But I'm gonna go ahead and name this guy after him because he was indeed the first person to uh, I'm gonna let to say something. So. He gets the worm named after him. So, Sid Man, the worm. Nice. <laughs> Let's see how long this guy ends up lasting. Well, we'll see. We're gonna go ahead and actually go heal up. All right, awesome. We can store your tired Pokemon to full health. Let's go ahead and do that. Thank you. And since we're here, um, I think we can go ahead and go to the next route, 103, that was above us up there. And let's see if we can't catch something up there as well. Because I'm not really... Okay. I'm not really trying to use the water over there because I can get an old rod later. So, okay, that guy's done checking footprints. But the objective over here is to catch a Zigzagoon or a Pujihina because those guys will both be fairly good later in the game. And here we go. Let's see. What did we get? It's a Zigzagoon. All right, awesome, awesome. We can actually use Zigzagoon fairly early on. I would have preferred Poochina just because he's a dark type Pokemon and he can uh, do some more damage, but that's okay. Okay, my objective is we're just gonna throw a Pokeball at it now. I mean, if not, I think I could tackle again and he should be fine. We'll see. We're just gonna chuck it out there though. Okay, that didn't work. Nice. All right, so we're gonna get him with one more tackle probably. Oh, wrong button. There we go. Let's hit him with another tackle. Hopefully he doesn't die. Okay, well, that was a waste of uh, an area. Okay. And also, let's go ahead and swap the two Pokemon. And let's put you out front, just so he gains XP from whenever I shift. And we're just going to keep grinding up here for a little bit. Probably. I could probably, I think there's another route that I can catch yourself. Oh, of course, the second one's a Pujin. All right. Well, we can't catch him, so gonna go ahead and swap over to Alf again. Use his tackle, of course. But our tackle is stronger. Oof, a lot stronger. Should be able to take him out in three hits. Oh, only two. Nice. Only need two. Let's go. So we got 15 XP and you got 15 XP. Alright. This is gonna be a long Nuzlocke, that's for sure. <laughs> With the likes of a Wormple at the very beginning. But, uh, yeah, that's that's all right. Let's see. You're about halfway to level three. Uh, let's go ahead and swap. All right, after this one, we're going to go heal. And let's go check out the new route and see if there's a new Pokemon that we can catch over there. I'm also going to have to talk to that dude that was taken down. Ooh, that was a good hit. Let's go. If only that happened, you know, the last time we fought a six again. <laughs> 8 XP. Ooh. <laughs> Hardly any. Alright. Let's go ahead and get back to the Pokestop, heal up, and then let's go talk to the scientist guy and see if we can't find a new guy. Yeah, rest up. Thank you. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, finished sketching the footprint of our Pokemon. It turns out they were only in my own footprints. Nice. And new route, 102. All right, so we can catch Pokemon here as well, I believe. All right, it looks like we get a trainer battle. Okay, cool. And I think this bottom left grass is probably going to be what we're going to shoot for next because 
it looks a little bit more promising. Okay, he sends out a Zigzagoon, level 5. Sidman, you're going to go ahead and swap over to Alfie. Alright, use his tackle. We know how to handle tackle. We just take it, and then we hit them with our own tackle. <laughs> Alright, they usually get first hits. Uh, I'll survive another tackle. Awesome. And then I can heal after this. Because I got some potions. Use on Alfie. Full heal. He's gonna hit me with another tackle. No, use growl. Smart move. Knowing that I would heal, so we went ahead and lowered my attack. But I should still be able to one-shot him. However, his speed is somehow slightly faster, so he gets to growl at me twice, which might kill him. Okay, cool. I didn't know how much that growl would actually take down. 31 XP. Let's go, level four. Let's go, Sid Man. And I got 31. Awesome. And we defeated the youngster. Cool. Yeah, you definitely should have trained more there, buddy. Alright. So, down here you usually catch bug type Pokemon. So we're looking at uh, Kakuna, um, a Weevil, and I think there's one other one that's likely to catch. But we'll see. What do we get? Another Wurmple. All right, we already caught this guy, so it doesn't count. This is not our first encounter. Let's go ahead and run away. And let's go ahead and uh, see if we can't find somebody else over here. Ah, another Zigzagoon. All right. Let's see if we can catch this Zigzagoon. I'm actually going to see what kind of damage this guy can do. Slash can be taken. Not bad. All right. This might be what we had to do. Because my other guy is probably just going to one-shot him at this point. So we're just going to probably do two more tackles. Get him down lower yellow. Okay, yeah. No attack now. Jeez. <laughs> we're to swap him. I'm just gonna see what happens. Yeah, of course you just tackle. Nice, good crit hit. All right, and now from here, I think it's actually safer to swap to Alfie just in case he doesn't get caught and does a tackle. And then we'll throw a Poogie Ball. And let's see here. All right, let's see if we can't catch this Zigzagoon. Let's go. Zigzagoon, zigzagoon. Yes! We caught the zigzagoon. Awesome. That'll be useful because this weevil is going to be kind of rough. So the zigzagoon is going to be great. All right. Nickname for the zigzagoon. The next person in the comment section was actually Jonathan, and he wants me to name it Mr. John. So let's do that. Mr. Overcase. Mr. Can I do a space? Yeah, okay, there we go. And then J. Lowercase O. H. N. Mr. John. Awesome. Even though it is a female, that's cool. I'm. Actually, you know what? I wonder. Can I, uh. I don't think I can go back. That's all right. Mr. John's female. That's cool. And let's see here. Let's see if we can't fight this guy. Let's go ahead and actually swap to my starter. Uh, wrong button again. Jeez. Alf. Switch to the front. All right. Bug type Pokemon. Here we go. He's got two of them. He's got a Wurmple. Of course, we'll tackle. Nice. Good kill. Level nine. And another Wurmple. Let's do some more tackling. Oh, sting shot. Smart move. Lower my speed, even though I'm already super slow. All right. Nice. Good double kill. Awesome. All right. We're going to go back. We're going to heal up. And then we're going to go fight that. I think there's actually two trainers potentially up top so we're gonna go ahead and fight both of them and then we're gonna go fight that little kid up in the top left and then see if we can't do something with the zigzagoon here actually see if we can't get the zigzagoon to uh at least level five before we're done here so let's go ahead and go up here see if we can't fight this guy Pujihina. awesome tackle the crap out of him nice hey buddy can we fight no, okay. Is there another guy out here? No, okay. I didn't know if there was no. Zigzagoon, we don't want to fight you. Cool. 
All right, so let's go down here. And let's talk to this kid and see if we can't fight him. No, okay. So we got both of you. Let's try this kid. Nope. This guy. I can fight this guy. Let's go. All right. Oh, he's got two Pokemon, too. Ooh, a Poojihina. Level 5 is actually quite strong. But we can easily double tackle, get wrecked. Level 10. All right. And I learned Water Gun. Perfect. This is actually what we need. Cool. And we can just go ahead and see what Water Gun does to this guy. Ooh. Meaty one-shot. Let's go. Yeah, that's about the only water attack Mudkip actually learns. And you gotta, like, teach him a whole bunch of other ones. So... I'm probably going to hold on to that one for quite a while, and I'm probably going to end up giving him Surf and, uh, like a Water Cannon or something like that, I think it's called. Okay, cool. Um, we have a few more trainers. Let's go ahead and fight them. Alright, who do you got? You got a Zigzagoon, which we'll just use Water Gun to see what it does. Yeah, it almost one-shot him. And then we'll use Tackle. Actually, we'll use Mud Slab, just because why not? <laughs> And another Zigzagoon. Again, we'll Water Gun and Mud Slap. Unless he dies, of course. He didn't die. Mud Slap. Psh. Nice. Easy double Zigzagoon kill. Got some more money. And, ooh, there's a treasure down here. Found one potion. Awesome. And then this looks like Petalburg. Okay. So we're not ready for Petalburg yet. We're actually going to give... Alfie another level, and then we're gonna run. Oh, I could have caught a low tad. I did not even know that. Low tads are actually a lot of fun. They're really good Pokemon. <laughs> Especially later on, they're insanely good. If I had known that there was low tads up here, man, I could have just not went down in the bottom. What's up? Alright, well that was an easy, easy double, double kill right there. Um, another Wurmple. I got another level, didn't I? Whoops. Alright, we're gonna switch over to... What's his name? Mr. John, which is actually female. Mr. John also has an item. But we're gonna put him up front, and we're gonna get him to level 5. So we went lower down just because these Pokemon are a lot lower and closer to his actual ability. We're gonna win this. Nice. Alright, I think you can survive one more fight as long as it's like a Weeple or a Wurmple little guy. Oh, it's easy again. Same level. Okay, good. I can I can still win. I growled twice. Maybe not so much. Okay, yeah. I gotta run after this one. Nope. Cool. I can win. Nice. Level four. Good job, John. And now we're gonna go heal up. And then John will be able to be level 5. And then once we get John to level 5, I think the Weevil guy could probably take on a few opponents as well. We could probably get him to level 5 as well. The tackling. <laughs> oh, of course he'd lower my attack. And he'd do it again. Don't care. Man, all there is is Zigzagoons over here. All right, so I'm going to have to go somewhere else, I think. All right, we're going to go heal first. <laughs> that was close. Full heal. Awesome. And let's try this grass down here instead. See if there's some more little, little guys. There we go. This is more on par for what we can handle. <laughs> I don't care if the speed goes down. He's still quick. And their tackle does a lot less damage. Alright, so he's got one more level to level 5. Okay, there's another Zigzagoon, of course. That was a good tackle, wow. Alright, well, we're just going to swap in case we can't run. <laughs> Jeez. Tackle. Okay, there's Zigzagoons out here for blood. Jeez. <laughs> That's alright. Alfie's got it taken care of. Cool, my Zigzagoon made it to level 5, and he got Tail Whip. That's not really not really that worth, but... Alright, we're gonna go heal up everybody, and the Wurmple is gonna get a chance to be level 5. 
We're actually going to go down to this lower grass down here because it's a lot safer. For my terribly leveled and horribly not good at fighting little wormple. Sorry, sorry, Sydney, if I'm uh, <laughs> making it sound like your, your guy sucks, but he kind of does early on. He's not the greatest just because he doesn't have a lot of attack power. But once I get to uh, the second or third stage, he's actually quite good. So yeah, we're just going to grind this to probably, actually, we'll go to level six or seven, I think we could probably do with him. Okay, this is not going to end well, is it? All right, I have no more attack. All right, so we're going to swap over to Alfie. Another Zigzagoon, great. All right. Not going to do any damage against Zigzagoons. How did I miss? Uh, I don't miss. That's not fair. Alright, let's try not fighting another Zigzagoon. Jeez. Alright, cool. We can't really win this fight. But... <laughs> nice, a crit. That was good. Sediment made it to level 5. Alright, awesome. And he learned Poison Sing. There we go. That's, that's actually useful. <laughs> it's a little bit better than Tackle, because it has a chance to poison, I believe. It doesn't do a lot of damage, but it does... I think it's like a 10% chance to damage. Oh, I didn't mean to fall down there. Whoops. I think I can actually fight these two trainers. Let's actually see what Sting Shot does. Okay, wow, that does a lot of damage. More than I expected. Alright, and a poison. Cool. Hurt by the poison, and tackle. And another poison. Tackle. Nice. Good win. I'm actually going to see if I can't fight these two guys down here. I'm not sure. But I'm going to switch over to Alfie just to be safe. I don't need to fight you. <laughs> Thank you. What about you down here, guy? Nope. Alright. And, of course, we'll put you back up front. A level five guy. Let's see if we can't get you up to at least level six. Expected to get a crit hit, dude. Can I please get him poisoned? All right, I can survive one more. <laughs> Nice. Alright, well, that didn't end up going as to plan. So we're going to restore to full health. Yes. Take your Pokemon. Great. And we're going to go ahead and travel over to Petalburg or whatever it was over there. And then uh, I think we're going to go ahead and end the episode there. Shadow Rule 102. We're just going to do 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 our way through here. Awesome. We're going to go all the way down there. Yep, Petalburg. Okay. I don't think we need to heal. Actually, let's check and see if uh, any of these guys will give us stuff. Warm berries, regen health, different types of Pokemon, different weaknesses. Cool. Fire type, great. Thanks for the advice. I don't know what that is. And you, trainer, smile there, hobby, collecting Pokemon, whatever. May I see your profile? Sure. I am a great Pokemon trainer. I am a Pokemon great. Sure. <laughs> nice. What does this lady do? Where's our Wally gone? No, that's not good. I don't know who Wally is, but that's foreshadowing for the next episode. But yeah, with that, um, I think I'm just going to go ahead and uh, end the video there. So let's go ahead and do a quick summary of my Pokemon. I got three of them. And we're going to go ahead and do the rundown of all of them. Let's go ahead and uh, get into the Pokemon. We have our first catch, Sidman the Wurmple, who's level 5, bug type, and prevents added effects. That's not bad. Shield Dust is a pretty good ability. So we can't be stunned, paralyzed, slept, all that junk. 
but he doesn't do a whole lot. He's got a little bit of health, he has zero, basically, not anything good. And he's probably not going to be good until he's Butterfree or whatever his third evolution is, but it's not even going to be that great. Um, so he's probably not going to be on the squad for very long. I'm sure he'll make it to the end, but I don't think he's going to be a, a mainstay, but we'll see. He could uh, he could do very well. Um, we have Mr. John, the female Zigzagoon, who's also level 5. That surprisingly actually has less stats than <laughs> the level 5 Wormful. But he does have a full heal item, and his speed is slightly faster. Therefore, he can get hits off a lot quicker. So I think that uh, I think this is going to do a little bit more work. But what we're looking for in the next episode is probably a Puchihina, a Lotad, and some sort of flying type Pokemon. Whether it be a Tallow, a Wingle. Wingle would be preferred, but Tallow isn't that bad for Taylor. And I think there's probably another one that I can get. Um, and of course, our level 11 Alfie the Mudkip, who is, of course, going to be the the number one Pokemon in our squad. It's going to do a lot of damage, do a lot of work for us, and just basically just going to be our powerhouse, especially pretty early on because of the lackluster team we kind of picked up. But we'll see what happens with this squad. But with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed, and um, yeah, I think that's all we're going to be doing here today. So. I'll see you guys later. Um, enjoy your day, your evening, whatever. Whenever I decide to actually upload this, I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to do that. But uh, yeah, have a good one. Peace out, everybody. <laughs>